going on YouTube, Legend Guy323, and we're back with a new video. And in this video, we're going to go over Doom that is releasing tomorrow, May 13th, 2016. And I am really excited for it. Um, as you can see in the background, I have a Doom beta plane. Uh, that is the Xbox One version. The main reason I went with the Xbox One version was because I had got the Alpha key uh, early. And I was playing the Alpha when it released. And then people with the Alpha got access to the closed beta before they opened it to the public so that was the main reason i played on the xbox one the xbox one version of the game uh it's eh, it has a lot of screen tearing uh if you don't know what screen tearing is it's when you'll see down the line like the horizontal of the screen like right in the middle of the screen you'll see kind of like a blurriness it's when uh you know how the frames are not in sync if, if you play pc you understand what screen tearing is but uh it, it's annoying screen tearing is so annoying so i'm i'm personally going to pick up the game on pc i have a reserve for pc i have the collector's edition the collector's edition reserved for pc and i will be picking that up tomorrow i cannot wait as soon as they announce the collector's edition is available for pre-order i went ahead and pre-ordered it right away um the only thing about the pre-order for or not the pre-order the only thing i would think about the collector's edition I don't think it's going to sell out. The main reason I say that is because not everyone is a fan of Doom. A lot of people don't even know what Doom is, especially nowadays. Since uh, Doom is a classic, the last Doom that came out was the BFG edition, which came out in, what, 2010 or so? Um, but they probably didn't pick it up during that time either. But they, they probably know what Doom is as a classic game, but they probably never played it. This might be a lot of people's uh, first Doom they ever played. If this is your first Doom that you ever played, let me know in the comment section below. Uh, I am so excited for the game. Whoops. Uh, so let's go over some of the Doom games I have. I have a few. I'm not the world's biggest Doom fan, uh, nor I collect for it, but I do enjoy the game series. So the first Doom show is the Nintendo 64 version, the red cartridge. And here's the box. Um, this version was pretty good actually it was pretty good it was not on par with the pc version back then but this was probably the best version for consoles back then and then they came out with doom 64 which i have here i've recently picked this up so i have not played this one yet i still need to play it um plan on playing it soon and then doom 3 this is the most played doom that i've uh, ever played and I have the collector's edition for that. I remember when I first saw this game was back on the, in a Game Informer in 2003 before it released. And when I saw it, I was like, yo, I have to get it. And during that time I saw it was when I just got my Xbox, origi the original Xbox. Uh, so when I saw that in the Game Informer, that was on my to get list. And then back then, this is how they released DLC. Well, yeah, well, it's not really DLC, but it's how they release expansion pack for games. They released them on disc. Here's uh, Doom 3 Resurrection Evil. And these were when id made a, made uh, the Doom series without having Bethesda published them. This was back in those days. And then they came out with the Doom 3 BFG, BFG edition. And this was published by Bethesda, but it was still, you know, worked on by id. However... This version is probably the worst version of the BFG edition. The load times in this game is ridiculous. And I don't even think they ever patched it. I think they just left it as is. So, I remember I was trying to go run through the game again. That's probably like a few years ago. Because I've been wanting to play it. And after dying, and when you reload your last load save, it took forever to get back into the game and continue on with the story at the point when you die you're like man i don't even want to play this shit no more because the low times are so fucking ridiculous so but that's that i should probably went with the 360 version but i got the ps3 version because during the life cycle of the ps3 and xbox 360 the ps3 was my least played console because i don't know i just wasn't a big fan of it um so doom 3 was extremely dope Let's talk about Doom, the new Doom in general. 
one thing I hope they don't ruin is the story. Because that's what the main um, core of the fans want to play is the story. They don't really care for the multiplayer like myself. The multiplayer was... It was kind of booty cheeks, to be honest. I mean, I might d play a little bit of it, but it's not my main focus of the game. My main focus of the game is going to be the story mode. And hopefully they deliver. One thing I'm worried about is I hope it's not a short story. I hope it has, you know, has a good length to it, very in-depth. I just hope they don't ruin it. I hope they didn't put all the time into the multiplayer and, you know, let the story be, eh. But then again, it has been pretty good with making games and stories. Uh, I personally like the game Rage. I thought it was pretty good. It didn't get too much praise for it, but I thought it was pretty good. Uh, the multiplayer, a lot of people say it was like a Halo. Because I guess the armor does look like Halo armor. Uh, like Master Chief's armor. But uh, it felt like Unreal Tournament. But I, I didn't really like it. I mean... It was fun for like a couple, maybe a few hours, but it gets old pretty fast. But it does have, you know, you could customize your armor, do all that good stuff. I don't think the multiplayer is going to last, to be honest. Like, they tried the multiplayer with Doom 3, and as far as I know, it didn't last. I heard it was booty cheeks. However, I didn't get a chance to play the multiplayer in this, because when I had this, uh, my parents didn't have, we didn't have... DSL at the time we still had dial up <laughs> so <laughs> I didn't get to play that by the time we got good internet was when Modern Warfare 4 was out that was my most played game at the time when we uh, got internet so the Xbox original life cycle is already done but let me know what you're going to get Doom for if you're going to pick it up if you're not going to pick it up you know let me know why is it not your type of game you're not interested or you just don't like the series at all um so let me know. Hit me up in the comment section. No, go ahead and hit that sub button if you're new. Uh, hit that thumbs up. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Let's get three, two, three. I'm out. Peace.